Good morning. Ah, I woke up. Well, Brody woke up at 7:30, and uh, I had to wake up with him. It's already eight or almost nine, I think. And Majid just left with him and Grandma. They went to Sam's Club. They were gonna buy some stuff, and uh, they are going to pick uh, to pick up some breakfast. So, pretty much, I'm by myself. But myself so I don't know if to edit one blog and today I work all day so it sucks try to vlog as much as possible but yes that's our day so right now that Maji they all gone we can say I'm able to pick up the house a little bit well I picked up last night before Majid arrived and Brody went um, went to sleep uh, he went to sleep really early, well, not really early, earlier than usual, but he went to sleep at 9.30, so I'm very glad about it. Um, I was able to pick up before my jitter, uh arrived, so now that they're gone, I'm able to actually do my face. I just fit, uh, I just fit the bed, so I'm able to do my face, get ready, easier. I can do that in the mornings usually, but um, they're all here. We're watching TV. We're doing things so early in the morning that I get distracted really. <laughs> so don't get me distracted, you know? So, yeah. Oh, these shorts I have. I don't know why everything happens to me. Like I said, my body just reacts during the winter so much and everything at once. Look, I uh have... -huh. Is it a cold sore? Oh, but it hurts um, when I speak sometimes. So, yeah. Okay, I did my face. Whoa, I'm falling. Okay. I did my face. And like I said, I've been using that infallible one, even though that is, I think, a little bit of the wrong shade. Just, I mean, I don't like to return things, but I'm going to finish it. And I feel like the light makes it brighter, you see? Like, it's not the right color. Should I put, like, some bronzer? I didn't put any bronzer, but I should have put some bronzer so it will make it dark. It's okay. I'm okay. Okay, so I just arrived home. And I only had two hours left before I go back. Because I said today I was going to work all day. But a friend of mine at work made me this awesome wrap. He gave me some onion raisin fries. And I have the half of the wrap in the other for Mama and Brody. But it's a fish wrap. And it's amazing. He cooks amazing there. So um, I'm going to eat it. I'm so ready to enjoy this. Well, he's awake. <laughs> I only have like half an hour to be with him. And then he just woke up. So half an hour and then I get to go back to work. But Brody brings me this book. For me to read it to him and I try to read it no I don't try I just invent whatever I see on the picture the thing is this book is in Farsi and I don't know how to do it so mama started reading the book for him and he takes it away from my hands like doing like you don't know this book so funny Okay, boy, my amor. Um. Oh. Uh, you wanna vlog? Okay. Uh, say hi. Yeah. Do hi. hi. Say hi. Mama. No, say hi. Hi. Can you say hi? No. Yeah, Mama brought this book for him because he likes it. Oh, he's going to sleep like the book. You see, the cat is sleeping. He's falling asleep too. <laughs> yeah. Is the cat sleeping? I like that she brought this book. I think that book belonged to Majid, right? Yeah, this book belonged to Majid when he was little. So uh, it's good because Brody get to see and learn the other uh, Farsi with it. It's everything written in Farsi. And the funny thing is about this. Well, in America, the books you open from left to right, right? 
Well, this book it opens from right to left, so I was like, oh my gosh, it's so confusing. So it's just a little bit complicated because they read from right, from left to right instead of left. I mean, wait, I'm so confused now. <laughs> Ignore all of that. I went to a brain, uh, like a just a brain fart right there. Anyways, I don't have that much time anymore. Hello. So Majid and I were back home. There he is. He think he's getting sick. Are you getting sick? Huh? Anyways, I am very tired. Um, I came home and I put Brody to sleep so he's already in bed. He's been in bed since 9 but I am tired because we woke up 7.30. And I haven't taken that. Where are you going? being creepy anyways but yeah he feels like he's getting sick and I feel very cold I don't know if the house is cold or I'm getting sick too and I hope I'm not you've been walking like a ignoring me huh <laughs> like a zombie are you being weird huh yeah you're a weirdo with the mullet filming me I don't, have, I don't have a mullet. Where do you see my mullet? I just want to know what are you doing there? <laughs> he just got himself inside the closet. The laundry area. Yeah, my husband is weird. It's okay. Back to the cookie. <laughs> you know, you look like those cats that they go and they just go like outside and inside. Kind of. Yeah, he needs to come out of the closet. We noticed, babe. It's okay. You can come out of the closet. It's I've been okay. out of the closet for a while. <laughs> it's okay. You see? He's dying inside there. Do you feel like you have a fever? <laughs> it's just weird. Oh, Jesus. He is definitely feeling sick. He's going into the medicine cabinet. <laughs> I wish I could translate this. Oh, let me. I will translate this. What are you talking about? What you mean, huh? Huh? Do you need medicine? Oh, yes, mommy. I feel sick. <laughs> I cannot translate this. <laughs> Look at him, he's dying. <laughs> Why do men f feel a little bit sick and they feel like they're dying? I heard it's true. I heard it's cause. <laughs> you are gonna wake up early and you're not gonna put him to sleep. Yeah. Men actually, when they feel sick, they feel like they're dying. So even if they get a little bit of fever or a little bit of cold, they feel like they're dying. <laughs> That's what I heard from a TV, from actually a talk show, show that is actually true. When women feel sick, we cannot be sick technically because we have to be doing more stuff than they do in the house. But I don't know. Does your men act the same way when they're feeling one sick and they have to be in bed already because, or they don't, they cannot go to work because they have like a little fever or like a little cold? Yeah, that's him. It's time to go to sleep. Are you still talking? Yes. <laughs> hey, that's why you bought me a camera so I can love to talk to my people. Because you don't want to listen to me. He doesn't want to listen to me. So I get to talk to you. He says I talk too much. Do I? Anyways, you want to say goodnight? <laughs> Good night, peeps. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. <laughs> Peace.